Hi and welcome into the Kitchen Sink podcast where we talk about everything but the kitchen sink. <laughs> Here she goes. <laughs> Guys, we have to record a whole intro and you didn't hear it. Um, where's the where's the microphone here? Down here. Oh, it is. Hello. But I don't want to keep going the screen like that. No, it's down here. Hello. Hello, everyone. Um, one minute, I just need a drink. And I'm going to reiterate, mm. if my posture slowly degrades, if our posture slowly gets worse and worse, please mind your business. Wait, we can lean. We can I know, lean. This I is know, fun. but I just know I'm going to be sat like this yeah, by the end Yeah, to be fair, these stools aren't the comfiest. They're not forgiving, are they? The, the thing is, my fat ass just don't fit on these stools. Because my, my mum was like, why don't you use these for the set? And I was like, that's a great idea, Tracy. But, in essence, my fat ass don't fit. And they're not the comfiest. Like, I needed something with a back. Back support. But realistically, like, the height on these would be brilliant. Yeah. Because the height of those chairs isn't the best. Is it not? Well, no, considering that I have to have the... If I didn't have to have the table above the radiator, it'd be fine. Mm. But but because I have to do that... Oh, but those chairs are cute. Oh, no, yeah. I don't regret the purchase. No. Let's get that straight. I actually saw someone the other day on an architectural digress, and everyone who's seen it, and a lot of people in the comments were saying, oh, I really like that chair, I really like that chair, and it's pretty similar to the chairs you've got. And it was in a celeb home. Slay. Can't remember which one. Maybe um, Debbie Ryan. I watched it. Who's her? Who's that husband? Who is she? It's from Twenty One Pilots. Don't know what that is. It's it. First of all, it's a band. Oh. Never heard of that. Why? Have I? Sure. I mean, don't get me wrong. I couldn't tell you one of their songs. Oh, there you go. Currently, I think he's cute. But no, he is cute. And I and also when they started it, I didn't know that's who it was. But obviously, I saw all the stuff in there, and it was like Twenty One Pilots, Twenty One Pilots, and right. he got like a music studio, and I was like, oh, so that's who's in Twenty One Pilots. Yeah. I didn't realise that, because I, I never knew who was in it anyway. I didn't know she was married. Neither did I. Um, I do live for Debbie Ryan. What's that meme? The one she's like... The Radio Rebel. Yeah, oh yeah. Behind the ear. Behind the ear. I love I'm her. I'm putting it on screen. Guys, anyway, let's actually um, acknowledge what's going on here. We're currently not in my office, even though I, we are home. Liam is up in Leeds. Yes. Um, basically, I couldn't be asked. Go, going in there because we're a little bit, we're, we're planning on getting more drunk throughout this yeah we're going to be doing shots this is going to be a drunk episode to be honest and I'm not going to lie to them I am loving the look of these lights a pre-drink with us yeah it's, this is essentially just a drunk pre-drink say it or shot it whatever the fuck I like that episode. I've got a halo yeah it's gorge I'm loving this light oh I just banged my elbow <laughs> I'm loving this lighting and if you're not watching then you, like I said did I say it in this intro or the last the story. one? Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, so I couldn't be asked setting up the like camera in the office with the set. With because it's real hard to film to record. Because I need to get my thoughts straight. Because do you know, as last episode, did yeah. you notice how it was in like I was in one ear, you were in the other? Did I didn't put it in it? here, so I put it on my. Well, some of you might have realised that, and I realised that, and it's because. I didn't film it in two... I didn't record it in two channels. You know, when I said to you... Yeah. In GarageBand, it wouldn't let me. Oh. That's what it did. It meant that, like, one of us was in one ear, one of us was in the other one. Which well, wasn't least, a bad thing. Well, at least now you're going to have but, two separate files. Well, this is the thing. Complete. I mean, it's probably not going to be that different. No. Is yours still recording? Yeah. The time's going up. <sighs> okay, Woo-hoo. perfect. Because that got me worried. So, yeah, we are still in my kitchen. with the opposite way to you guys. But if you were sat where we were, we are now, you'd be able to see me sink. But I kind of like this tradition that I've been on now twice and neither time I've been on set. Right. I kind of like that. I like, okay. I like feeling, you know. Right. <laughs> now, I don't know if you feel like feeling special would be the word or the odd one out would be more apt. I think the special's correct. Okay. Um, but yeah, so you might hear some glasses clicking. You might hear other sounds like... Oh, it's not squeaking now. Well, <laughs> well, I thought you'd hear the, some chairs squeaking, but I guess not. I did, in fact, break the one that I'm sitting on. So, who knows? Might go falling. Isn't there a film where that happens? It... Oh, up the asshole. Yeah. Liam, you need to use your words. It's a podcast space. Oh, sorry, everyone. Sorry, all um, your listeners. What he just did was he asked me if I remember the film where someone sits on a stool and it breaks and the pole, obviously, that... Goes up the bum bum. Yeah. What, is, what is that? There is a film... No, I don't know what it is. This isn't the comfiest on the elbows. See, squeak. Did you all hear the squeak? 
Sorry. But, um, yeah, we've got no idea what we're talking about today. So if you're with us and you stay with us, I do thank you. Congratulations. I've got a point to start. It's oh. yours. Yeah, mine's squeaky. I think this kind of... We've, been done, we've done two episodes now, both kind of centred around our nights out, but this is a big part. The pre-drink has always been... Of course, it's a big part of everyone's night out. But I feel like for us, we used to film it. We started right from the beginning. Guys, we did loads of Say It On Shot... shot another. Say It On Shot It's. They're on the channel. Yeah. And they're embarrassing. And we used to sit at our little... And we used to chat shit. Yeah, we did. And we used to sit in that little kitchen with that wire hanging behind us. With all the different haircuts, all the different ugly outfits we wore. And we used to do truth or dare. we used to sit on little stools. Little stools. We were sat on little stools, guys, in front of a washer. Yeah. A washing machine. Yeah. And it was not the best quality. It, but there was not. there's moments in it, like the one where you made me drink washing up liquid. Yeah. And you made me... Eat pesto. Pesto. <laughs> But you always compare that. Washing up liquid and pesto are not on the same I'm not caliber. trying to say that they're the same thing. I'm just saying they're both disgusting. And when I burnt my I mean, fing- one could kill you. And when I burnt my fingers on the plate, not on the pizza that we got out of the oven yeah. fresh, yeah. Absolutely. And I was thinking about the other day when I, when that pan was really hot and it went, it sizzled and I had pulled that face. So, <laughs> that is a funny video. Guys, I'll tell you what, if you've not seen it, I mean, I'm going to fill you in. It's a... What did we do? Handcuffed together for 24 hours, wasn't it? Yeah, we did challenges. We did, and it was fun. Guys, I'm not being funny. We have done challenges after challenges. We have. We're bringing it to you, everybody. We really did. But yeah, so fuck knows what's going to happen this episode. Um, but hopefully you enjoy these more relaxed episodes. I've got so many burps and I'm so sorry, but sorry. this is what happens when I drink. And where do we go from here? <laughs> do we start on it and say it or shot it? I feel like we should because I'm not drunk. Well, let me get my vodka on you, entertain the people and Liam, explain. honestly, that chair needs to start squeaking. And explain what say it or shot it is. Obviously, it's quite sad. Oh, my God, yeah. Okay, so some of you might not know. Also, I will say, if you're not 18, maybe don't watch this episode. Or don't listen to this episode either. Even. Sorry. No, you're fine. Because, realistic, if you think I'm shot in that... No, I'm going to get for me. Okay, great. Um, because, realistically... Some of these say it or shot it's are probably going to make us say some really disgusting things. The other... That are to do with sexual intercourse. That's what usually happens. Yeah. But you, essentially, you didn't explain, but essentially... I know, but I want to give a disclaimer first. You didn't give me a fucking chance to explain. <laughs> Go on. Essentially... It's Liam Hill's podcast now. <laughs> yes, it is. Welcome See back. ya. There's a, question, there's a question from the audience. From there's you guys. so many background noises, Liam. I'm going to lose my fucking mind. There's a question from you guys, and... We either say the answer, or if we don't want to say it, the forfeit is to shot. Now, I think that was pretty self-explanatory within the title. Well, but just in case you're all a bit thick, there you go. Liam did tell you, okay? <laughs> now, I don't know if mine's going to go off if I scroll it off or mine... and get my questions. Surely not. I don't think so. So you just talk for a sec while I get my questions. <laughs> okay. Guys, this is difficult. This is slap dash. Wait. What? I'll get my iPad. I can get the questions on there. Oh, okay. God, I love technology. <laughs> okay, there she goes. And you goes. can all still hear me and I'm so far away. Well, here's a part of projects we, we can talk about before we start this, maybe. Go on, then. Outfit choices. Because we have been through the ringer with outfit oh, choices. That's great a good one. segment. It looks good, yeah. Outfits. Because I remember, so when we were back, when we were back in uni, we, we spoke about this on the last pod, podcast about when you're first going out. She's died. I've got mine. Oh, but you I need my Instagram. Oh, but I'll God. put her on charge while we, while we talk about this. Yeah, okay. Sorry, guys, this is all over the place. <laughs> Where Essentially, when you start going out, you kind of want to slay. You want to wear a little crop top. Da, 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 da. But not even just slay. And you want to do like, the most. Do the, yeah, do too much. You just want to do the most. And I feel like we've really evolved since then. Like today, I essentially I have a white vest and jeans on. And I said, I'm not doing any more than that. I'm not, we used to do full faces of foundation and makeup and everything. But that's really classic. The white, the white, the white vest and a, or even just like white top and a jean. That's really classic. Um, I was thinking like, it depends where you're going out because sometimes when I'm going out to like an event, like the vibes are just to do, are still to do the most. And I can't wear that little under, under boob thing and like a little something. But well, this like- is the thing. It, de- it depends on the environment. People in Leeds aren't doing the most. No. And not that that should des- necessarily deter you. But guys, it's an interesting one. Because we, we, I feel like the first time we went out in Leeds, like properly out, out in Leeds, yeah. we did the most. Did we? What was, what was I that? Recall, I recall us going out, doing the most. And then we were like, oh my God, everyone's looking at us. Everyone was in just like basic jeans and t-shirts. When was that? What did we, I think I remember too. But also, I've got another thing to say. There's a way of doing it where it looks good. What? Basic, basic? Basic jeans and t-shirt. I've got another burp. But do you know what I mean? Yeah, hello. It's the fit. I'm going to give you some notes. 
Some of you, I'm not even going to talk to you guys that are watching it because you guys aren't the problem. It's the straights. It's the straights. It's the, but not even the straights because some gay boys can't dress. There's a lot of people that can't dress. You know what? We're not bashing the gays. We're not doing it again. We're not getting it. We're not doing it again. I'm not allowing it. Um, anyway, some people don't know how to do the fit of their body. Now, don't get me wrong. I, I can sympathise because I don't know either. My body is difficult. My body. She changes my body. Um, she changes... She plays up. I also think... Right. I'm not done. <laughs> um, and it's knowing how to fit the body. Like, if you're going to do a jean, like, do you want to go skinny jean? If you've... Not really. No one... Were, well... well you can, there's a way of doing a skinny jean, though. I think also... I think the problem for me... And it's me, what you pair with the skinny jean. Exactly. I think the problem for me is that people... You, sometimes you can't tell the difference between somebody's going out outfit and somebody's going to the pub or going to Sainsbury's outfit. Yeah, I this think is the thing. It's like, I, I've got tops in my... Ensemble? No, in my wardrobe. Oh, Thank okay. you. Ensemble, that's what you've got on. All right. So what you mean, thank you. <laughs> Guys, if you, know, if you don't know that, that's why we're laughing, but it, that's an inside joke we use all the time. But anyway, moving on. So I've got tops in my wardrobe, right, that... I would never wear on a night out because it's just too daytime. Like, how often do we put clothes on our body? Our bodies. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's also an inside joke. Um, and it, it's just daytime. So daytime. Like, this, don't get me wrong. I'll just give you one two-step. This is not... This is not a lot. Look at the material. Insert picture here, right? This is not a lot. But it's the way I've done the fit. Yeah. It's a tight little vest. Showing a bit of the Calvin Klein, showing he's got a little bit of money, right? It's the jean. <laughs> there we are. You know? But like, it's, it's even like if you get Calvin's for, for Christmas, mm. save some for your nights out because it's impressive. It's, but people, like, that's just what I'm saying. They go to the. They'll, it's the illusion. They'll that's go to Sainsbury's and then go straight to the club. I like, I don't, I mean. I do can. It, live I, your life, but I like to feel like I'm going out. I had to change my underwear because I didn't feel like I was going out. That's what I mean. I like feeling like I've gotten ready and I'm going out. And I want freshness. For myself more than anybody. I want deodorant. I want hair done. And I was also, this is on makeup as well. Let's talk about makeup. We used, as I said, we, say, <gasps> we used to do so much. We can find pictures. Guys, I did, we used to do so, so much. Especially me. I'm sorry. Yeah, you used Not to. Not to steal your thunder. No, but you but used Liam, to. you've never done like Full beat. the most. Guys, I used to do. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I used to, right, do my eyebrows, which I still do. I do a bit of soap, brow, through the brow. Done, right? Then I used to do concealer or foundation or both. It was always both, bitch. Okay. It was both. Um, both. <laughs> then I used to do uh, cream? No, not usually. Sometimes. I think like I evolved into cream. Yeah, but you said... Because was... I was dry to begin with. Yeah. And I've always been dry. Yeah. So I thought, let's do cream. Up. Yeah. So I started off... That was you. I didn't God, these stools, man. These stools. Um, it used to be powders on powders on powders. But then I learned a little bit about makeup, you see. Because I do like makeup videos. Mm. Um, sick for the J's. <laughs> um... <laughs> So then I did evolve into creams because it does help you help your skin out. For all you dry girlies out there, I do feel you. Mm-hmm. Right, my hair is blending into this blue light behind me, and I kind of like it. I love it. Um, but yeah, so obviously started doing creams. So I used to do concealer, foundation, cream contour, cream contour or bronzer, mm-hmm. blush, cream blush, highlight. That, that cream br- that was a nice cream. cream yeah, blush I've still got it. Um, highlight. I used to. Fill in the beard. Fill in the brows with powder. Fill in the brows with powder. Mascara. Gloss on the lid. Black Gloss mascara. Gloss on the lid. <laughs> Bl- you black. Just, you just cracked. Black mascara. Black well. mascara by Ray. <laughs> Stream that on Spotify. <laughs> Honestly, I've said on air that she needs me on a on a PR team because I, I thought you were going to say on the, the, on, the, on, the, on the pod. Ray. If you want to come on the pod, I'd happily, <laughs> You're talk, welcome. I'd happily talk about the Who new album. Who doesn't want all this? Absolutely. <laughs> Look at this budget. <laughs> right? Get on the pod. I'll see you soon, sis. Um, but yeah, no, so... Black mascara. Black mascara, guys. I never was that bad. Like, I used to just kind of spot conceal a bit of mascara. Yeah, you kind of used to... You, you kind of did what you do now, but like a bit heightened. So you do like a bit more on the on cheeks. The cheeks. But, like, you don't have, like, a beard to think about. Never. And all, but there's one picture of us when you got, first got back off the ship, and it was at my house in 
Hackney. Yeah. Pristine. And we looked so good. Middle was, Park curls. That was the best makeup Pink day we had. curls, people. That was like Pink the happy curls. medium of not doing too much, but also like just doing makeup enough that it looked like you were wearing makeup. And it, I had a bald head. See, you don't think I looked like I was wearing makeup that day? No, but uh, no, that's what I'm saying. Like it wasn't looking like you were wearing the... You know, it wasn't cakey. <laughs> wearing the geish. It, it wasn't cakey, but it was like, oh, she's got a little... Well, to be fair, we never did it cakey. I always knew how to do makeup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, don't get me wrong, probably at the very start, it was interesting. But now... But, like, I knew how to do makeup. Like, the application was good. It was just a lot. Like, I didn't need to be doing all that. I remember you came back off the ship, you were like, your makeup's got better. I did say that. Because it used to be not cute. It used to struggle. It used to struggle. But also now, like, we were just doing it now, and I was saying to Brad, what I do now is more of a psychological thing. Mm. Like, I think it's, it's just, just a little pick me up, a little something, yeah. Like, it, and it's not a lot, but it's just what I want to make. I think it's that's the difference. Is I used to kind of think about what I would look like, and now it's like how I feel. Yes, which I love, mm. and that just makes me feel together. And all I do is a bit of soap brows through the eyebrows, and that's literally it. And a prime. and that's what you call growth. Yep. And that's that on that. Um, so that's makeup, outfits. Do we really hit on outfits, or do we just? I'm, just bash? Trying, to th- I'm trying to think of like phases. Because we, we used to go all out with the outfits too. Like I used to wear mesh. Mesh, mesh the, velour, the velour tops from ASOS. And I mean, yeah, but oh my god. Those like, velour tops. Guys, if you look at the very first video, don't look at it. Why have I not put it private yet? That's a problem. I don't know, because I'm miserable in it as It's well. a problem that needs to be solved, and it will be. Mm. Um, but guys, we, we used to wear, he had a blue one, I had a pink one. Hated it. My shade was never correct also with the foundation. We never really hit on that. That was... The shade match was questionable, okay? The velour tops. What else? Mesh. I used to wear skinny jeans. Skinny jeans with the knees ripped. Yeah. Yeah. No it stuff. wasn't a look. I didn't look good. And but I still pulled. And that's saying something. But I feel like I used to... Oh, God, this is kind of reading myself. I went through a long phase of not. And I think it's because I was what, doing... Pulling? Yeah, because I think I was doing too much. Right. I was doing too much. And right. I feel like... I remember when I was young, like younger, when I first went to heaven, I used to just do black jeans and a t-shirt. Like, very simple. You used to love your... There's a top that had words on it. Unite, the Unite one. Oh, Guys, I used to love her. Guys, that shit out. I got rid of her. She's gone. Oh, no. End of an era. Also, I used to <sighs> have a long phase of wearing shirts und- like with one button done up right by the belly button. Yeah. So it was just open and chest and tits. Mm, so did I, to and be honest. That was a moment. And he's, he's Guys, when Liam off. gets drunk, do you want to give him an impression of what you, what you do when you're drunk? Or should I do it? Yeah, you do it. Because I think I'm better at it, I'm just be flop- I just go floppy. Because I, I can see. Yeah, Guys, I, can, I can't feel. This is what he gives. <laughs> it's the, all neck yeah for the audio all listeners no neck for the audio listeners it's bobble head yeah it's those it, tell you what it is it's those toys <laughs> that when you press them on the bottom they go flat they he, he's just feeling his outs and I think that's a beautiful thing and I now that one's not the broken stool so I don't know what's going on there is it let me look no it's is wait that? is it wait I think the screws come out of this one that one's cracked <laughs> Oh, so that's the problem, isn't it? Guys, I've broke these fucking stools and they're not mine. We would just say nothing. Oh, yeah. As long as they're still intact. Don't give a fuck. As long as there's and two I, stools To be honest, here. I rarely sit on them. First question I've just memorised that I've just been to look at my iPad. Um, have you ever been sick on a guy's willy? Never. Oh, she's saying it on the pod. Never. Proudly. I haven't either. And do you want to know why, guys? I don't like... Look, I don't like... Do I need to go that far? Yeah, <laughs> why not? I don't like sucking dick. God, that's brave. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Hi, my name's Bradley and I hate sucking dick. That's so brave of you to admit. Yeah, no, I, I, no, to be honest, it's not that I don't like it. What it is, is it, I only really suck a willy if I'm in a relationship with it. I just think it's not sexy. Like You love it. I don't, don't even start this. No, I wasn't, you don't need to say that. You don't need to tell my tea, thank you. <laughs> you can cut that out. She loves that. You can, you can bleep that. Absolutely not, it's a drunk episode. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's not that sexy or it's not the I, I don't think it's a competition of how much it can go in just gagging on something it's I just think that's it's not she cocky it's never been cute like crying choking no because that's what it is I hate that because that used to happen to me like don't get me wrong I'm not even going to go there I'm going to oh you're going to keep your business quiet because no, I was going to say some disgusting things there okay I'm going to mind my business mm. um, but that that used to be it for me like I used to ha- I used to hate the crying, the watery eyes. Because you know me as well. I've always had watery eyes. Guys, I tell you what, I used to suffer bad with my eyes. Mm-hmm. Don't get me the bone dry these days. They actually are. They don't water anymore. Oh, never. I love that. They're taut. Yeah. And no plastic surgery. They are. They, they used to be saggy, didn't Guys, they? Guys, saggy the house. They did. Um, but yeah, so 
that was always a thing for me. Like, I used to walk, my eyes used to water and cry. And I just don't think that's sexy. It's not. I, I don't think it's sexy to, like... No, I, I... No, if anyone wants to, you know, I'm down with that. But right. I'm not, I'm not returning the favour. It takes a while for me to warm up to the thought of taking a thick rod. Yeah, but there's other things that you prefer to do. Absolutely. I'd rather gobble on some asshole first. <laughs> <laughs> Not gobble. <laughs> gobble. <laughs> gobble on some ass cheeks, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I like it when Kaji says gobble like turkey dinner, bitch. Absolutely mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> honestly, honestly, I'd rather that. That could never... But, to be fair, the only reason why that's a preference... A, or of a preference, even. The only reason why that's a preference... Cut that. <laughs> <laughs> um, is because I tell them beforehand that ass better be smooth and washed. And that's the reason why. Exfoliation. Whereas I don't, I, I don't care to know about the dick. Interesting. Whenever I'm having sex with anyone I don't know that well. Or at all. Excuse me. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> um, like, I don't really care to even see the willy. Ah. But I know how to please. Don't get it twisted. Anyway, that was, a, that was his first shot I shot it. Yeah, I need another drink. Shall we just do a shot? Hmm. Just to warm up the guzzle. I've poured mine already. Guys, do you like my little shot glasses? If Are you're watching, they, they say... Mauritius. No? No. Marmaris. Marmaris. Mauritius. <laughs> That's in a song by rating. Oh. Because okay. you don't want that. You always slate my toffee vodka. Here's a question, guys. Toffee S- vodka. <laughs> Sound off down below. Do you think that toffee vodka is a sleigh? I think it is. Can you stop writhing around in that chair? <laughs> <laughs> because it's breaking. And it's not... It, it's miss, no limits. Missing a screw. So you want to be careful. <laughs> you can replace those. I have got the screw. It's in the drawer. Well, there you go then. I just didn't put it back in. Back to this issue at Go Pam. on, talk Do about you toffee vodka. Toffee vodka. I, Brad always slates me, but I think toffee vodka's... Brill. Heaving. I think it's gorgeous. Guys, I just spilled. Sorry. I'm glad I wiped this down before we started, just to make it a mess again. Um, cheers to you and to your mother. <laughs> Oh, you fucking bastard. I forgot how sad... I forgot how bad... You should try my toffee one. It's really smooth and nice. I forgot how stingy vodka is. That's a warm, sweet sensation. I'm so happy for you, but the taste of toffee would make me heave. The reason being is because I don't think personally that the toffee should be in a vodka. Like, for me, it's like, imagine chocolate vodka. That don't work. That's not the same thing. Listen, it is. Because fruity things, for me, work. Like, raspberries. Now, but it's, it's pretty limited to some fruits, too, Liam, because I wouldn't have banana vodka. Mm. Ooh, absolutely not. Potassium vodka, I'm all right. Whereas, like, for me, it's just, like, raspberry, strawberry, blueberry. And it doesn't, they don't actually taste like the fruit. It's art- artificial flavours. Orange. Which is, is even it, worse. Wait, why is there no orange vodka? I think that would be delicious. That would be gorgeous. That would be my favourite. Well, that's a screw. That's orange, a screw. Orange and lemon. That's a screw. Orange and lemon. <laughs> that's a screwdriver. That would be delicious. What? What would Shut it be? <laughs> um, so yeah, that's, that's my problem, is that I don't think toffee, that's a dessert. Because I love toffee flavoured things as dessert. Like, as much as an X girl. Ice cream. To- toffee ice cream, fudge ice cream. <laughs> Delicious. Werther's. I love a Werther's. I mean, they're cute, yeah. Have you ever made it yourself? Get a normal vodka, dissolve a packet of Werther's in the vodka. See, that does not appeal S- to or me. Or Skittles in there. Oh, that's delicious. But that's because they're sweets. Toffees are sweets. No, toffees are dessert. Mm, I disagree to entirely. To me, toffee, fudge, caramel, all desserts. I disagree entirely. Sound off down below. Toffee, fudge, caramel, they're creamy, Fudgy, desserty flavors. Do you get my drift? Whereas Skittles, they come in what? Raspberry, blueberry, orange, lemon, palm, palm of violets. For coming out of that. <laughs> I'm sure you can make that into a vodka. That would too. be. Do you get it in gin? Delicious. Pa- I don't like palm of violets though very much. I like them. But yeah, um, we're gonna take a quick break and we'll come back with some Saint Anne's da da da. Perfect. <laughs> and we're back! <laughs> With an egg timer. Not sure if you heard that on the uh, on the audio here. But guys, 
I just thought it a great... I, words. Do you know what? This is a drunk episode, so you know what? If I'm slurring, leave, leave it out. Right? Because we're feeling a bit drunk, guys, and we've not drank that much. Am I a lightweight? I get, Maybe I, I am now. I get a bit of a complex about this because people, some people say, "Why?" I don't know if I am or not. You are. You are. I'm a heavyweight. But then I'm shock. But then <laughs> the other week I was out till like six a.m. and all I had was a vodka soda, and I was living. Yeah, but that just depends on your environment. Yeah. I was Is dancing. the music was the music good? It was like techno. And you, I mean, you do turn it up for some like, some stuff like that sometimes. <sighs> I was dancing all night. That's one thing, guys. I don't like techno music. It depends. I need lyrics. I, did you like what I was playing earlier? It was decent. Like, yeah. That's light. Very light. And I like that. Well, yeah, because it's like Black Mascara by I love Ray. That. That's I love those little songs. Techno-y. Yeah, just like camp, like little electronic yeah. songs. It gets a bit deeper and I like it. A little bit deeper and I like that. Uh. Then it starts to... When it's just like... <laughs> oh, no, I don't like that. I don't want it. I don't need it. I, sh- I don't crave it. I struggle when it's one tone for hours. Mm. But quite often the events I've gone to are kind of changing every few minutes. Because... Okay, back to the egg timer. All right. So, what we've got planned is, obviously, we're going to do say it or shot it, right? My iPad is a little bit charged now, so we can, like, look at the questions. And he's... That's rattling and it's annoying me. <laughs> but what we're doing is, say it or shot it, which I've got a few on Instagram, not many, because I literally put it up, like, half an hour ago. So we've not got that many, or not many good ones. Sauce guys. But what we're going to do is... We're going to do the say it or shot it. We're going to start the timer and every five minutes it'll go off. Now, this egg timer's fucked. So it doesn't go off when it's supposed to. It goes off a minute thingy. A minute off. Yeah. And then it carries on ticking. Oh. Yeah, but it doesn't buzz again. Okay. Well, let's just see. So we'll just do six minutes and it'll buzz at five. Do you know what I mean? Go. Wait, because we need to understand why we're doing this. Because... Most of the time, guys, we find it hard to just n- not say something because we're pretty open with the internet. Which yeah. We probably shouldn't be, but we are. Well, this is how many how many times have we done this? <sighs> too many. No, never too many. We haven't done one in ages. I know. So this is this is June. We did one at Halloween. This Halloween. Yeah. But did we do a long one? Dressed as fishes. Did we do a long one though? No. I feel like it wasn't a long one. It was pretty short lived. Didn't something die? I feel like the camera died. Probably. But yeah, so we're going to set a timer for five minutes so then even if we don't say the say it or shot it and like we, we just are fine and don't need to shot, every five minutes we'll have to do a shot. Anyway. And by that, the end of this, we should be pissed. I'm ready to go. Yeah. Okay, so first one. Do you want to start the timer? You go for I'm it. just going to put my phone down. Do you want me to twist it and you hold it? Yeah. Okay, let me see if I can see the thing. Ooh, Ooh guys, it's hard to twist. Teamwork, go. That'll yeah. be fine. When it, the lings... We've got to take oh, a shot. Is it ticking like that? They won't be able to hear that back there, will they? That's going to be Shot it over there? Yeah. I'm going to move it over there because we don't need to hear it. Sorry, guys. I'll I didn't open, really think that through. I'll, open, I'll open the iPad. <laughs> <laughs> this is chaos. I'm sorry. If yeah, you but you know what? You tuned into the, the drunk episode. But what did you expect? We've already got, what, half an hour left? Go and get a drink that's not a tea or a coffee. Yeah, guys, let's get pissed. Go anyway. And join in. I've got to say it or shot it for you. Okay. And I don't even know my answer, so we might, have, might just have to shot because we don't know. Okay. Last, what was the last time you lied? <gasps> and like, I need you to be serious now. No, that's still ticking down. Sorry but, if you can hear it. But nah. It kind of adds attention, I feel Yeah, like. they, they won't be able to feel it. Um, <laughs> 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 when was the last time I lied? Ooh, I like don't a, know. Like a white lie or like a lie? No, like a lie. Lie to me. I never lie to you. Neither do I. Look, I don't lie to you. Right? Stand up. <gasps> Guys, I'm breaking this chair. Nah, she's fine. Sit down. It's more effort than it's worth to lie to you. It's just more effort than it's worth to lie in general. And what do you mean, just to me? Oh, because you, I will find out. Because we speak every day. Guys, truly, we speak several times a day. It's, sometimes it's stupid. But I think it's because now... Do you know what's going to be really sad? What if one of us gets it's into a, a relationship? Then the other one's just going to be left in the dust. And I've got a feeling you're going to be the one that gets into a relationship before me, and then I'm going to be fucked. Because I live on my own. Bitch. I live on my own and I'm going to be lonely. But do you know, do you know where it started? What? In lockdown. It started yeah, in lockdown. we lived together. We lived together for 83 days and I moved back home and... It was over 90. You can fuck off. Well, maybe 100. It was over 90, thank We you. lived together for a long old time. Yep. And then I went home. Over three months. And I remember I was at home 
with people and you were on your own. And I was and sad. So, yeah. And so then we got used to just speaking more often. And I think it's just spiraled from that. Yeah. And also, I just like to tell you things. Yeah. Like, a lot of things happen during the day. Yeah. And I'm like, who can I tell? Liam. Yeah. And it's just, I, I know you'll just listen to anything yeah. I chat. And we support each other, guys. What, does, what have I lied about? This is my question. What have I lied about? Do I lie? I don't lie. I know, but it's such a juicy question. Can't we just make up a lie? Um, I don't lie, but sometimes I don't say things. Ooh. See, that's withholding the truth. <laughs> yeah, it's not lying, but sometimes... sometimes. But that kind of is lying. But it's because, it's for my own th- self, because sometimes I don't like to get, have other people have an expectation of something that I'm doing, and if it goes wrong, I don't want to tell them. Do you know what I mean? So sometimes if I've got a casting, I'll just not say that I've got a casting. Oh, bitch, you does that... <sighs> just so then if Guys, I don't... he does that all the time. <laughs> so I'll be like, I won't tell, I won't tell anyone... So if I don't get it, nobody knows. And it irritates me, guys. I'm not going to lie. Because you want to know. Let's get real. Let's you get know. real on the podcast. Let's you, have a bit of therapy. Because you want to know which is nice. Guys, I want to know everything because he's my fucking best friend. And I tell him everything. Mm. Best believe any little thing, even a comment, down to the comments, down to the likes. Everything. Right? I tell him everything that goes on. I know everything about you guys. Oh, absolutely. Everything he knows. Right? This motherfucker does not shed information until it's crystal clear or has happened already. Until it's hard, heavy pencil in the diary. Hard. Yeah. Until it's hard. Fact. And it pisses me off. Because I, I find it so easy just to just I know, give birth to the audience. I just, because then as soon as somebody knows, in my mind there's an expectation. And I know there's not. But in my mind it's like somebody knows and so I have to update them if I don't get it. And I'd rather just not. <laughs> yeah, but also like, if, you, if you don't get it, then I'm going to be like, oh, well... Better luck next time. Yeah, on Who the cares? next one. Yeah. But then also on the flip side, sometimes I've... Because be- the thing... I've got a reason why you need to tell people things. Okay. Because mm. people want to be excited with you. So like if you've got an exciting casting and you've just been to it, mm. I want to know so then I can be excited. Like, ooh, Liam's going to find out. Ooh. Yeah. It's called being a good friend. I know? know. I know. And, and I'm not calling you a bad friend. No, because that's something I also that I need to work on. It's mm. like, I always think that people aren't going to give a shit. Oh, and I give so many shits. Yeah. I shit... This, we know. You know? <laughs> this, is something, this is something I need to work on. Yeah, but that's not a lie. But it's not a lie. It's Because like, well, as soon as I've got something, you know. I know the last time I lied and I can't say it. To who? Ah, <laughs> oh, that is the last time you lied. <gasps> and I can't say it. Get me my, get me my vodka. <laughs> get me my drink. This oh is really hard to do. Because it's so high off the... Oh, I thought I'd nailed it then. Spill out. Guys... Lies. Lies will, lies will get you. Karma. Liza Minnelli. That's my boyfriend. I wish she was. Karma is a cat. Purring in my lap. Because she loves me. <laughs> anyway. Bing. Why did I do that? Don't ever do that. I hate again. my life. Do you know what I want to talk about? What's that? Furries. But that's not today. We'll talk about that tomorrow. No, I want to talk about it. No, tomorrow. I want to talk about it right no, now. No, tomorrow. Because that relates I've just, I've just purred like a cat. We can talk about I've furries got, for one I've second. got one. I've got one. Okay. Can you just tell me if you'd ever want to be a fairy in your life? Never. I could see you as, with this haircut. I could see you as a fairy. A fox? I don't Absolutely. even want to see a fairy. A ferret? Because <laughs> Simone on, doing it on Drag Race was enough. <laughs> Oof. I've got one. Controversy. Wait, <laughs> I need to shot this. Three, two, one. Let's go. Mine's a light one. Oh, it's... That's stopped. I've just done my shot. That stopped. That time has stopped. Does it not ding? It just did. No, it didn't. Liam, I'm gonna... It's never dinged. My tongue. It's not doing well. Get a shot down here, come on. No, I didn't... It's not gone off. It's just gone off. It stopped dinging. Listen. I know, but that's... Get a shot down you. I've just done one. You search for the next... Do it, say what shot down. I'm going to check this. Because this is not correct. <laughs> Oh, it is. No, it is. It is, cool. it is correct. Shall I set it for another five then? Yep. Another five on the clock. Do you hear that, guys? Tick, 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 boom. Okay. That's going to be so over the top. There we go. I'm going to pour myself another shot of my delicious... See, I'm trying to find ones that we won't talk about, but we will. I know. Do you know what I mean? I was going to go biggest pet peeve. That's so light. It is. Vanilla. Worst relationship. I've only had one. Do you want to talk about it? Mm, because it wasn't that bad. That's really unfortunate. I've had some bad ones. Like my friends now. And you know what? If you want to hear about mine, you know where to go. There's an episode on that. Right. Like my friends now, we actually spoke today. What the fuck is that all about, guys? I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. It's depressing for me. Because yeah. you don't... The thing is, I want to badmouth exes. Liam can't do that because he's had one and he's still friends with him. 
the fuck? What yeah. am I supposed to do in this situation? Although, one thing I can bad mouth about myself <gasps> oh. is about myself. It's kind of reading myself. Oh, it's good juice. Because I was chatting to him a few weeks ago because I was talking to somebody and essentially... Have we, you shot? Yeah, just. Great. We agreed to be friends. And my ex, mm-hmm. we were talking about it and he was like, oh, you've been friend zoned again. Wait. He said that? Yeah. Because it's the tea and he's not wrong. He's all not. I ever seem to have... Guys, he gets friend zoned often. All the time. Because I'm likeable, but clearly not lovable. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so I'm sorry. I'm so glad you're empathetic to my pain. Anyway, Liam, get a grip. <laughs> you're going for the wrong guys, clearly. Um, I'm going to burp again. Smash or pass, Harry Styles? I mean, smash. come on. Hmm, smash. You, you, you was on the fence about that. <laughs> you'd hmm, pass. Uh, you'd hmm, smash, Harry Styles. <laughs> Excuse me. There's no doubt in my mind. Not one. I'd spread those cheeks. And I know they're hairless. I know it. I think they're just... No, 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 no. Smelly. Nah. Smelly, smelly, no, I know he's smelly. pristine. He's pristine. No. Harry Styles There's pristine. a rumour that he's got smelly balls. Sickening. Put them in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I say. Sickening. <laughs> and, I, and I don't suck dick. We've talked about this. Right? Just. But I'll put them in. We've covered that. Um, Do you want to go on the internet? Yeah. See if there's any good ones. What should I search? Say it or shot it questions. <laughs> okay. Hard. Pinpoint that word. Okay. Talk Hard. to people. What else can we talk about about our, our experience going on? I'm pretty Hard. drinking. Hard. Say it. Say Do you know what I want to talk about, though? I want to talk about those, about those baby names. Well, play that game quickly. But that's for babies, in it? Yeah, we can do that tomorrow. Guys, we've got a baby episode coming. I know these are going to be for straight people. I just... <gasps> there it is. No, it's not. That's not been five that, minutes. Amy, that... <laughs> my name's not Amy. Never been. <laughs> <laughs> That's my eldest sister, so guys, sorry about that. I don't know where that came from. Liam, that's, that's, been, that's been the time. Oh, these are for straight It's just people. blinged. No, Liam. it's not. It's still ticking. I told you, it, br- it brings a minute before the end. So what did you put it's it at? It's not been four minutes. What did you put it at? Five minutes. It's been four. It's not. It has. It simply has. It has. No. I'm sorry to tell you, but it has. Should we wait for it to stop ticking? Oh, Brad, we can just, we can say every, all of <laughs> this these. This is the problem. We're too open. It says, have you ever gone skinny dipping? We've not gone skinny dipping, but we've been naked on the that beach. That was interesting. I know, we were naked on the beach. Guys, in Alicante, <laughs> we were if, there's a vlog on the channel. <laughs> <laughs> and if you watch the vlog, you'll notice that there's no footage of us naked on the beach, but it did happen. And we yeah. have pictures. And I look sickening. I don't. <laughs> Actually, I do. I look skinny because I just got off the, you know what? Oh, uh, trauma. And, uh, yeah, trauma. 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 Generational trauma. Uh, <laughs> these are not good. I'm not ready for another shot. Well, what can we not say? That's the thing, I need to ask you a question that you can't say. I need to stop breaking this chair. What's the drunkest you've ever been? I feel like we have to... Do you know what? I'm going to add on to this question. Okay. If you're going you to... You need to say what you did. Okay. When you're at your most drunkest. And I know several things that you cannot say. I've been... Listen, I've been... Liam, I know several things that you cannot say. Like what? Where? In the club. <laughs> And you can't say that. <laughs> and, I, and I will bleep that. <laughs> Just for you. Sucking dick and cock. And that. Oh, of course. Yeah, I won't say that. So get, is that what I've done? Yeah, no, I, yeah. You have several times and I know all about it. <laughs> right. Now, what if I, I don't think I've done that crazy, that crazy stuff when I've been drunk. You were sick out of the time. But that's different... not crazy. I can talk about that. You... Being sick and, sick and sick. Let's talk about it. Because... I've been sick. Who hasn't? No, guys, it was not just sick. Projectile vom. We got one taxi, and uh, he said... First of all, shot, please. Thank you. Why? Oh, I can't drink it yet. <laughs> because uh, you can't say what you've done. He was sick out of one taxi. Hmm? And he was like... We argued. <laughs> oh, we argued. But I'm going to be sick. <laughs> we argued the <laughs> house. And so we opened the door, was sick, got kicked out of that taxi. Then we're sort of on the side of the road, we had did. to get another taxi. Which, you know what? In hindsight, I, I, I feel like I gave... I gave him some choice words. Maybe 20 minutes down the road. Uh, well, I'm not done. I'm going to be sick again. Liam. I'm going to be sick again. I, get, I gave him some choice words, I feel like, in the, in the moment. You were harsh. But I, but Say I, what you said. This, uh, wait, to you? Oh, no, I meant the, I meant the driver. Oh. but I, We can't talk about what I said. There we go. That's too mean. That's too mean. <laughs> but that's not part of it. <laughs> Is that it? Um, but... No ticking. You've got to get two shots down you. 
No, I, I've already done one. Oh, have you, you done haven't. It's still <laughs> you right haven't there. still right there. Okay. I'll wait till you do yours. Okay. No, do the first one now, and then I'll, we'll do one together. No, because you're not going to say. Yeah, I, we are talking about it right now. That's not the worst thing you've done. Is that the worst thing Be you've mean done? to you. I think that's the worst thing I've done. Oh. And we're still friends. Exactly, because it wasn't that mean. And I think I apologised. After a while. Let's not get on to this subject. I apologised after a while. <laughs> like, six months down the line, when you brought it up again, <laughs> we were partially drunk again, <laughs> I said, you know what? I am the better man. And I am sorry. sorry. Which, absolutely. <clears throat> but stick out of two taxis, that was not... But I feel like you've probably been mean to me loads. I'm mean to you every day, bitch. What's the meanest thing you've said to me? Um... To be fair, there was, a, there was, to be fair, recently, if we're going to get into it. I said something mean. No, just like you were, you were grating on me a tad. When? Recently. What was I doing? Just like when I, it was one day we were FaceTiming loads, as usual. Yeah. Um, oh, I remember there was one day that I felt the tension. Yeah, like one day, guys, he was just ripping into me all day. What was I doing? And I don't think, you, you definitely weren't doing it maliciously. Oh. Absolutely not. But it was like one day where I really couldn't take the banter, but he was really serving it to me. (laughs) Piping hot people, right? And it was every time we called, it was something else. (laughs) And I was already feeling ugly, fat, and disgusting. (laughs) And and he he was just driving it home, driving it home. And I was just like, why is he calling me to degrade me when I already feel like shit? I didn't know. Yeah, and I, and I never actually brought it up because I was like, it's, it's more of a me thing. Like, I was just kind of pissed off. Right, well, I apologise. You don't need to. It's fine. This is the thing. People, I, I, our sense of humour is that we just dig into each other the whole time. Guys, all day today. All day. We've been chatting shit. But if, if there was a day where Brad wasn't, wasn't calling me out on stupid shit that I was doing and like little... If I was to trip over and Brad wasn't to go, you're right, after that little trip, or if I was to say something stupid you didn't say anything after, I'd be like... It'd be weird. It'd be tense. Yeah, but yeah, there was just one day where that really kind of got to me. But I was like, it's more of a me problem because we know what we know what I'm like. I fluctuate in mood. Well, there we, we are. We all. Do, I mean, <laughs> we're talking about fluctu- <laughs> we're talking about fluctuations. <laughs> um, we all do, right? And I was just having a I was having a tough day. Things were getting stressful. It was that. What day was it? I remember. I think I remember. It, well, I'm glad you do. I think I remember sensing it. But yeah, that was the only that was that was the only time I think I like. You said really mean things to me, and it got to me. Yeah. Usually, I'm pretty good at just like you know, water off a duck's back. Because realistically, whatever he says to me, I'm probably thinking, I'm worse. Yeah. So it's usually not too bad. But yeah, there, there was that one time where I was real mean to you. But I mean, I was drunk under the influence, and I'm very drunk at that. Very. And it was just out of character for me, and I did apologise. Yeah. Um, and I still apologise now. I'm so sorry. That's absolutely fine. We're but okay. you know what? We're, We're still it. friends, guys. We're like five years past it. It's fine. Legit. Guys, it was uni. And also, I'm in a very different place. We both need a shot. Come on. I know, I'm just looking for the next one. I'll pour you a shot if you want while you look. No, I have this one. Um, have you ever been caught masturbating? Oh, I have. I know you have. And so have you. By who? I think you were almost caught, but it was basically uh, caught. I'm... I was caught. You were caught. I was caught red fucking handed. Do you want to tell what you were... I can tell. I can talk about it. I've got, I've got a shit to say. I'll shut it that you won't say. <laughs> Well, that's rare. Do you know what it is? What? You're aiming these at me now. <laughs> and I feel targeted. And I feel, I feel unsafe. I feel attacked. I feel attacked and I feel unsafe. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. <laughs> Cheers, thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Hello, good morning. <laughs> I'm fuck. <laughs> I got caught masturbating. <laughs> Did she buy you your parents? Leah. Oh, by Leah, yeah, because you were in the top bunk. Yeah. And you know what? I'm surprised it didn't happen more. Because I was wanking. <laughs> I've been wanking. I w- I've been wanking. Guys, I was like, I think I was like, I was of age. I was 16, probably 17. I didn't move out until I was almost 18 because that's when I went to uni, mm-hmm. right? I've been wanking. Mm. We all have been wanking. Mm. Um, and we had bunk beds. We shared a bedroom. My, my family home literally had like three bedrooms. So it was like my mum and dad in one bedroom, two of my sisters in another bedroom, me and my closest sister, who you, you guys have met, Leah. Yeah. Sorry about that, Klein. It was a cup. I hit it. Um, and she did, she did catch me wanking. Because I remember just jolting up, putting the Covers mister back over. in his uh, house. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I remember her just being like, whoa. Like, she, like... Just, she kind of stopped in her tracks. I stopped in my tracks. She walked back out and I was able to sort myself out and get up in my bunk bed and we didn't speak about it. We've never spoke about it. Never. I should think, I should speak about it. Yeah. With her. I should bring that up. I feel like there's been times where I've had similar, like... But my parents very rarely just... Because I didn't share a room with anyone. Nobody ever really just walked in. 
This is the thing where my house was very like close knit, everyone shared. Yeah, I just had a knock knock and I just threw the covers over and I was like, yeah. But it, they uh, know. You're led there like, yeah. But realistically, you're a young boy. You're a young boy. I'm living my life. Things get stiff. Blood gets in, you know. <laughs> Here's a question. Oh, God. This is going to target me, guys. And I'm going to have to shot. And I'm not ready. What's the strangest thing you've ever put inside your body? In this way or others? Otherwise. Okay, let me think about this. <laughs> I, I'll talk about it. You'll talk about it? I don't know if I'll talk about it. Because <laughs> I feel like I'll talk about it now because I'm wavy. Tomorrow morning when I edit this. You're a public figure, bitch. Tomorrow morning when I edit this, I'm not sure if I want... Just imagine 100,000 people there. But realistically, it's a podcast. Not many people listen to it. Several thousand. A couple yeah. of thousand. You know, this could go viral. I mean, a couple of thousand. This could go viral. That's still people. I don't know if I want to talk about that. I think, I don't think I should. think you've put some crazy things in there, too. I don't think I have. Vanilla. That's sad. And it's sad. I just have no interest in that. I'm not ashamed. You know what? Self pleasure, guys. I've got to talk about it. <laughs> you want to talk self pleasure, guys? Talk self pleasure. You know what? We're talking about it. <laughs> this is embarrassing, and I may as well talk about it because I posted it on social fucking media. Twitter. What's Twitter? I'm not giving that out. Ooh. <laughs> okay. That's my saucy space. <laughs> <laughs> um. So. This morning, this this is coming from me live. Is it today? It was yesterday. It was yesterday. Sorry, I got my timestamp all muddled up there. Um, basically, yesterday morning, I had a woman knock on my door, and it's guys. I'm sorry, it's an abrasive knock. When you're in this flat, <laughs> yeah, that was my clock. Don't worry about it's it. It's been an hour. No, it's just under. Okay. We didn't start straight away. Um, it's an abrasive knock when you're living a flat block and you've not buzzed anyone in, mm. and someone's. Come fucking knocking. It's worrying. It's worrisome. Now, in my last fight, it was even worse because it was in the room. In your last fight before that, it was even worse. Scary. We can oh, talk about that. Me up. We can talk about we'll that. We'll talk about that tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> Break, breaking stories, guys. Breaking <laughs> stories. Oh, I feel like we've got to talk about that in something. I'm sure we have, but I want to talk about it again. We've got it. <laughs> because we need to go into it in depth. <laughs> yeah. But, um, so yeah, anyway, yesterday, <laughs> I got a knock at the fucking door, abrasive knock, I was scared, I was in my undies, I was in my undies and probably a top, so luckily I had a pair of joggers on that door frame right there, drying. The grey ones? Yeah. <laughs> and I, what, I ragged them on, ran to that door and I was like, I was eating my bagel, right, so I was half mouth full, woman, lovely woman, didn't take a name, didn't need to, God almighty, I'm glad I didn't. Um, went to the door, answered it. She was like, hi, I'm here for your inspection. I was like, brilliant. I remember, right? A week ago, they emailed me, inspection time. Well, hey. She was like, right, needs to come in, needs to take pictures of every single room. <laughs> right? <sighs> gosh, gosh, you're not ready. <laughs> um, so I was like, oh, totally fine. Come on in. I'll sit in there. Come on in. I'll sit right there. If you look in the background, I'll sit right there and I'll eat my bagel. I'll finish my bagels off, right? She went round and I thought, Fuck. I've left. My device. My wanking device. <laughs> in the tub. My flesh jack wanking device out in the bathroom. In, in the tub, bitch. And guys, it took, like someone was like, maybe she thought it was like a toothbrush, like cleaner. No, no. no it was an anal cavity. <laughs> Just, and it looks like one. It looks like an asshole. Yeah, it does. It does. And I was trying to think, God, I hope... I, <laughs> Maybe she didn't notice. <laughs> Maybe she didn't notice. Hopefully she was just like, you know, snapping pictures, moving on. But it's like looking back on those pictures. Oh, it stopped ticking. Fuck. We'll do a shot in a minute. I need to finish, sorry. Yeah. I was thinking, fuck, how many people are going to look at these inspection pictures? That's worrisome. We don't know. Flesh Jack the house. But you know what? It's natural. Who cares? Self pleasure. It's completely natural. Do you know what that means? Adam for Adam, sponsor me. That Love Honey, me. sponsor me. Bonzara. Bonzara, sponsor me. Absolutely. I've had people ask me to talk about it. Really? On Through Twitter, though. How weird. Yeah, but Twitter CD. Saucy but yeah, I've had, I've had some, like, sex toy companies be like, do you want to do... And you know what? I feel like that could be a natural progression in my channel because realistically, I'm pretty sexually, sexually open. Yeah. 
And I, I think, you know what? And you're all for that. It's natural. Shove things up there. I've shoved. You know what? You didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do a shot. Shall we? Yeah, because we're bordering on an hour. Guys, this has flown by. I'm feeling loose. Oh, I'm I? barely spoken. <laughs> Sorry, take it away. <laughs> you fill the audience in. Anything you want to tell them, Liam? Go on. Got you've, got, you've got a platform. I've got nothing to say. Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he will say. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do a shot. Do you know, speaking of not withholding the truth, I'll tell you something after this. I can, it's quite interesting and fun. I feel like program. I went off on one there with that story. I'm so sorry. It's it's absolutely really fun. Took a I was like this the whole time. It is my podcast. I was like this the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> the kitchen sink. Boots. <laughs> I was trying to do a noise of like a drain. Da, 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 da. <sighs> Guys, I've said this before, I think, in an episode. But if you didn't know, the little da 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 is actually from High School Musical 2. If you didn't know. But now you know. These are for straight people. Always, whenever you say, our, what's, the say naughty, our, "What's the naughtiest I'm thing not, you've done on a first day?" Finish this. When, whenever, whenever you say, "Our shot," it's ever for straight, straight. Why are you typing "gay"? <gasps> Should I try? Because that would be. More, I, I reckon as soon as you're typing "gay," CD, CD. Because that's always the case. The gays don't hold back. J Y, put your fucking hands up. It's Charlie X X. Oh my god, is this you? Don't. Surely not. Hello. It is! Welcome. Fuck off. If you search in gay, say it was hot shot it, you're the first link. <laughs> first khaki! <laughs> <laughs> and that's on popularity. <laughs> that's a bigger culture, mate. That's on gay icon. <laughs> and you're not even signed in, so it's not even like. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. Guys, type in gay, say it or shot it. There I am. There's nothing. There's no, there's no links to these. Liam. Yeah. Let's do a shot. Clink. Wait, let's get that ASMR. Nice. <laughs> I held it in the gob. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Um, guys, for the last segment, we're just going to chat shit because we, we can't. We, the thing is, we've said this and we'll say it again. We're too open for say it or shot it. The, the thing is, say it or shot it is for prudes. In all honesty, that's who it's for. Say it again. It's for prudes, right? It's for people that... I don't want to... Boring. I don't, don't want to say it. Boring people. I can't I, I'm poss- I can't possibly say that. You know what I mean? I ain't got time for that. Oh, I am who I am and that's fine. <laughs> I do what I do. And sometimes your friend will say it for you. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> With no filter and doesn't care. Okay? You need to drink some more of this. Bitch. Or- you, you're trying to tell me that that's the same as that. You're a fucking liar if and I, a scoundrel. That, you're a liar and a scoundrel. If we pour these into the same glass, that would be way more. Because look how wide. It's not possible. That is not the same as this. That is so thin. Are you Brad, fucking joking? Are you are you joking me? That's the point. That's Look at this. Nearly the same height. Nah. Nah, nah, nah. That's more. That's more. That's what I'm saying. So I've drunk more than you. No. Mine's more. Mine's more. Yours has got nothing in that. I've had more shots. Shut up! No, you haven't! I We're know. not arguing on the pod. We're not. <laughs> this is kitchen sink and this is a safe space. God almighty. What are you going to drink when we go out? Vodka cam. Always. I'm not going to have... I hope, right, I hope um, our friends... I'm going to say his name on the pod. I hope he's working. Yeah, because she's cheap. She's super nice and super kind. I always say, do you want a drink? And then he never says yes. But I don't know if he was, he's allowed one when he's working. He's on, dr- he's on, yeah, he's on fucking work. He's working. He's I've not got, allowed to drink. I've got another friend who used to work at Heaven. I've met, and I know two people that used to work there. People at the club that we're going to, guys, hate me. Yeah, that's too. They hate me. And it's not for, not for anything I've done. Super drama. It's like, something happens, these people take it completely out of context, into fiction. Is it fiction? Yeah. Into fiction. I wasn't sure which one. Non-fiction, fiction. Mm. Into fiction, people. They take it like, it's now a story, a narrative that, that creating, they are painting yeah. of me, which is not correct. Um, I haven't seen, to be fair, I haven't seen that particular drag queen in a while. No. So, who knows? They might not work there anymore. I wonder what the drag performance... I, I just hope the songs are good. I always forget there's going to be drag performances. Yeah, I'll probably see the one that I know. Yeah. 
To be fair, some of them have not been bad. Like the one at Christmas used to make it, me they're, laugh. They're, they're decent. The one that was weird was a pilgrim one. Yeah, that was odd. Awesome. There was a weird pilgrim one at Christmas. Dance, and there was a... <laughs> Got a hair in my garb, ignore me. <laughs> <laughs> Just get a hair in my garb. I was on set on the other day. On it's a been sh- three minutes. I know, into I, was this on, clip. I was on set the other day. <laughs> Whoa! And there was a guy that was a model and he had to wear a wig. And it was not a cute wig. And he had lip glogs. And all day he was going... Lip glogs. He was going... <laughs> Did you all hear that? Lip glogs. He was going... He was, he was going... <laughs> My hair keeps getting in my lip gloss all day. <laughs> That's so inappropriate. And it was so cringe. But he was like, he wasn't just going like, like that. It was. He was, he, yeah. Like, uh, nothing, and I was like, you want to see, this is the thing, they don't know how to handle it. I know, mean, it was gross. On, another thing about that Aaron, shoot. Aaron, I've got a question. Hmm? You talk about that shoot first. Another thing about question. that shoot. See, it's not lying. I just haven't, I've just left out details. There was a, a model that walked off set. She came in. That's, that takes balls. Yeah. She came I would never. The way I would never. She came in and she introduced herself. We were chatting. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Went for a, Got the wig on. Was sat down, whatever. <laughs> wig. Turned around. It was, and it was a Juno Birch. <laughs> wig. High wig. And we Jesus, turned around. Jesus, Madge all Simpson. Sudden, all of a sudden, she was gone. And they were like... For what reason? Because the wig? Nobody knows. Just went. Just left set. So unprofessional. I'm sorry. And so we were all sat there. There was outfits ready. We were all ready. Makeup was done. Just left. Unprofessional. Um, so they, so I stood in, essentially. Welcome. She said, I'm ready. Well, the stylist was like, we need a third, like, I've got six looks. We've only got two models. Oh, my God. So unprofessional. I hope she never gets hired again. Yeah, so that, the... I took that back. So the look I showed you, with the... Mm. That was one of them. That was supposed to be hers. I don't know, but... I... To be honest, brutal. Yeah. Brutal look for a lass. I don't know if that was meant. She's not expecting. There was it another to... one where I had a big thing, and it was like, yeah, and then that was a whole other thing. Question for you. Yeah, I think you'll find this interesting. Okay. Worst job you've had. Oh my god, worst job I've had. Yeah. And if you can't say it, you're gonna have to what? shop this as a modelling job. Just in general, like oh, worst easy. one. I can name my can worst. You talk about the it? worst. Day. Yeah. Talk it about it. I wasn't modelling. It was just working. Talk about it. I was working for an agency, um, like a waitering agency. No, we're not talking bubble. We're not. Cool, I'm, I, I want to talk about oh, perf- okay. like performance. Oh god, what's the worst show I've had? Modeling. Okay, you know because so that, that's what you want to do with your life. Okay, so what is the worst? The, job talk I've had? chatting shit about bubbles, doing nothing. I need to think about it. I need to think about it because because if you can't talk about it, shot baby. Because I haven't had a job. I've had this and I've had Twicky and <laughs> Twickenham. Twickenham Twickenham Stadium. Twickenham Stadium. Oh, I'm so sorry if they see this. But it was not cute. It was not You're talking cute. about it. And I've not been asked back. She's talking about it. I did a children's performance of Princess and the Frog. And I was the frog. See, I thought you lived for that when you did it. Are you for real? You, the way you played it up to me. And I had to wear a big frog's head and big gloves. You played it up to me. I but you lived. I didn't... No, I did not live for that. And I had to wear... Princess two, and the Frog. Princess and the Frog. Big big frog head. Big. You were the frog. And the prince. Big you were the prince. I know. Now that's a gag and a half. Big frog head, big frog hands, two pairs of tights, white tights. It looked sickening, to be fair. I remember seeing pictures. Yeah, it was pretty stay. But that's... Stay. That's, that, <laughs> that's one of the worst jobs I've had. What else? That was, a good, was, qu- that was a good question, wasn't it? There was one... <laughs> Look at me go. There was one where I did an editorial and I turned up and it was like... There was, there was one that actually went, what turned out to be one of my favourite jobs. And I had mm. to wear a whole Lycra cat suit. Aubrey's calling. Should we get Aubrey on the podcast? Go for it. Aubrey, you're on the podcast. Do you want to talk to the podcast real quick? Oh, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, she's, she's, she's about... She's showing, my, she's showing me my niece. To be honest, we're nearly finished. Oh, Liam, look. We've got to go see her tomorrow. We've got to. That was my question. Are you coming tomorrow? We're going we're gonna to see in the morning. Depends how drunk we are I and how dead. But I would really like to because I miss her a lot. I've been missing Liam. <laughs> I want a baby. Guys, I want a baby. I want a baby. Oh, right. <laughs> Liam, when are you going to have a baby? No, not anytime soon. I want, you, um, I want you to have two boys. Two young two. boys. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Two, two young two. boys. All right. <laughs> oh, Liam, look at that. Look at the face. Oh, my God. Guys, my, my sister's had a fucking baby and I, ooh, she's gorge. How's Caitlin doing? It's fine. She's just having to sleep at the minute. Okay, good. Rest that. Oh, my God. Madison. Cool nanny. Yeah. I've got an infection in my tooth, though. Oh. Leah, this is not chat that I need to be having on the podcast. Can we can we oh, finish this off oh, soon? Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
<laughs> well, there you go. I think that should be the end of the podcast, to be honest. Yeah, because I was about to slate some companies that I work for. We're not going to do that. <sighs> See, we really, we really. <laughs> Chair again, though. It's all right, break. Let's again. be careful. Um, right, well, we're gonna finish on that. That was my sister and my baby niece. If you could hear some screaming, Aww. she wasn't screaming much. She's a really good child. Like, no, bitch, she doesn't wake up. <laughs> she doesn't, guys, she just sleeps. <laughs> she just wants to sleep. Just like a mother. Absolutely. <laughs> Truly. <laughs> Truly. But yeah, she, she's a really good baby. Like, guys, she doesn't cry. She'll cry and she'll let you know if she's, like, hungry, needs changing, whatever. Don't cry for no fucking reason. She's sound asleep. And she... It, it, guys, let me tell you this. It's hard to get her awake. Aww. And I've, I've struggled. And I've tried. And I've shook her. I'm excited to see her. She's real cute. So, well, Alia said she'll be at the gym for what? 11. Half 10, 11. Well, we'll have until probably about like half twelve, one ish. Yeah, that's, and that's fine because we usually wake up at like what nine. Yeah, I don't nine sleep. ten, and then have a Mackey's. I don't sleep well after going out. No, but I have a Mackey's every morning afterwards, even though I tell myself not to because fat. But fuck it. <laughs> also, look at these before fat we go. This we can close on this. Look how cute. Look at the mushrooms. We got material. If you're listening, just listening. It's holding up a mushroom, and it is in fact a salt shaker and a pepper shaker. That's a pepper shaker, Lovely. and they are gorgeous, and they're heavyweight, and they're delicious. Can you wait, wait, next wait. Each other for fuck's sake. Flat tour coming soon. <gasps> Flat tour coming very soon. We're going to film it tomorrow. I have to add it to the list. Yeah, you do. Because we need to get up and clean this place. Yeah, and then do the flat tour. It's not that bad. No, it's more of this area. Mm. But guys, no, the flat tour is coming very soon because the flat is basically finished. Like, I, I've been, like, renovating. Renovating? Yeah. Bit of a stretch. Um, redecorating. Yeah. Redecorating the bedroom just because I wasn't happy. Like, I was happy but not elated, you know? Yeah. Um, and I've taken it there. And I've put some money in. <laughs> Let me tell you that. I've put some funds. I've, I've put some funds in there. I can, I can... On just some fucking curtains and bedding. Let me tell you that. I can attest. But you know what? They, they come and it's an experience. It's the packaging. That's what you pay for. See, this, is what, this is what we really get each other about 20 yeah. times a day. No, this is what I get phone calls about 20 times a day. Don't call me out. You call me just as much as I call you, thank you. I do. I call you mostly in the morning. He does. Because I wake up second to you, usually. Mm-hmm. And I say, hello. Usually I'm awake and I'm going to the gym. And what I do is I get a coffee and I put a video on and then 10 minutes into the video I say, I want to talk to Brad. Of course he does. Because who you? wouldn't? Who wouldn't, you know? <laughs> Anyway, on, on that note, on that note, I think this has been the episode. God. How do you feel? I feel drunk. The <laughs> same. If if it, this, it, was, this was the aim of the episode. If you've made it to the end... We're not sh- commenting shit because it's a podcast. You can comment you. on YouTube, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, go on then. What should they say? It's up to you. I say um, every toffee time. Toffee vodka. Ugh. I heart toffee that, vodka. That's a bit long. One word. Go. Boots. Boots. If you made it this, this far... And you're on YouTube, comment boots. And if you're not on YouTube, give me a five star review. And if you have already, thank you. And if not, go on. Please. I'll wait. Thanks. (laughs) And I want it to be a glowing five star review. Thank you. Um, But with that said, that's another episode down the drain. I'm going to put that again. Let's retake that. (laughs) Restart that. That's an (laughs) opposite. That is another episode. Down the drain. Do you know what I need to get? Mm? A drain sound. Oh no, that's gross. <laughs> no, it's fun. Sound effect. Gross. I need a wee. Goodbye. Wave. Bye. Okay. I, can't, I was waving like this.